Hi y'all. <clears throat> I'm Renee. Welcome to my channel. Look at that. I have a salad, southwestern salad from Chick-fil-A. I also have the uh, soup. I probably might eat that later. And I got a sweet tea. So let's get my salad dressed. Can I do this without making a mess, yo? So I have the season strips. Do you put everything on your salad that they give you? How are y'all today? My day is going good. No complaints. Although I'm gonna have a little ranting session. I hope this week doesn't turn into rants. But if this could help someone else avoid the situation I went through, then by all means. <clears throat> It's a beautiful day here in Columbus, Ohio. I felt like a salad because <clears throat> after running around the uh, airport, In Atlanta and, and then the John Glenn Airport in Columbus I was like okay Renee when you're at home now that I'm home now see while I worked like during my lunch or break I would go walk around the parking lot and just being home for almost two years I want to show you guys my soup I got the tortilla soup There we go. So, so yeah, the other day, um, on payday, I was paying my bills. In that. Uh -huh. um, I had, um, went in to go pay my water bill let's go back two weeks now the last time payday was so I went in so my bill was like six hundred dollars from I paid four fifty and then um two weeks later <coughs> <coughs> has a little kick <clears throat> mind you um so i'm expecting my bill to be the balance <coughs> and this is my first time paying online so i go online two weeks later and my balance is still saying 600 hmm. immediately The traffic is too loud but I just went and paid it to zero so I paid another 600 I paid it to six hundred dollars so I just blow my mind I'm like why is my wire bill that high so I called the automation service and it said I only owe hundred and fifty dollars so that would have been about right so I called them and I'm like I'm like what's going on here um uh, I said your bill is only like one fifty, and I said, "Well, when I paid online, so anyway, 
he confirmed my bill was 150. I said, well, I overpaid. I said, when I went online, it says six. It said six again. And I'm checking my uh, account like, did I pay it? Or did I not pay it? So um, I just didn't want any beef with the water company. So I paid it. Now I'm calling to find out why is my bill so high? Um, so they're like, oh, you only owe one fifty. And I was like, well, it says 600 and that's what I paid. And they said, oh, you had to scroll down. So, okay, that part, my fault. I never used online before to know how to go in there and look and see whatever. So I said, well, I would like to get my money back. He said, oh, well, you'll just have a credit on your account. Well, I don't need a credit on my account. I want to get the difference return. So he said, well, you could either go through your bank and stop it there. He said, oh, how did you pay online? Let me check, you know. Now, mind you, I did it that night. The next day I'm calling. Oh, let me see if I could stop it from here. He couldn't stop it, of course. And then um, he's like, well, he said, you can either go to your bank and stop it there. And then they're going to charge us $25. And then we're going to charge you $25. You'll see that $25 on your next bill. And then he said, or he says, um, we have to hold it for 30 days. Now, mind you, I paid electronically. Mind you, the money's already out of my account. We have to hold it for 30 days because you could go back to your bank. We give you back that money. Your bank gives you back that money. And then now you got $1,200. And he was like, we have to hold it for 30 days. And then um, you can request it. And then that's going to take six to eight weeks. Um, I'm going to have to wait two and a half money, two and a half months to get my money back. Someone please help me understand that logic. Someone please comment down below. <laughs> you have people calling you all day long. Trying to scam people. And here you are dealing with a legitimate business that's trying to scam people. And the thing is, thankfully, that that wasn't my last. But if it was, even if it wasn't still, return me my money.
it wasn't the person's fault that I was speaking to, but you sound like a young guy. Hey, what if it was your money? What would you do? Her salad's so good and fresh. Grilled chicken, grape tomatoes, black beans, corn, romaine.
You guys, thank you so much for joining me. I hope you pulled up a meal and joined me. <clears throat> but yeah, let me know down below. What you would do if you overpaid. And they're telling you to wait two and a half months to get your money back. Bye.